pray so much in Lent? It's one of what they call the three pillars of Lent. Praying, fasting, and giving. Grown-ups often say praying is a way to get close to God. But what does that really mean? Does that mean he's going to move in next door to you? Or give you a push on the swings? Well, not exactly. It's kind of like when you make friends with someone, how you talk with that person and you make jokes with that person and you play with that person and you spend a lot of time with that person. The more time you spend with them, the more you get to like them. And then you hang out even more. Spending all that time makes you get closer. So when grown-ups say praying is a way to get close to God, they're saying praying is a way to talk with God and become better friends. The Bible says, draw near to God and He will draw near to you. All kinds of people like to pray all kinds of different ways. Some people like to pray in the church. Some people like to pray at home. Some people like to pray out in nature. God hears you from everywhere. So try anywhere. Sometimes people wonder, why would God want to talk to me? I'm just a little person. And God created everything. Well, the truth of it is, that's why it's so amazing. Even though you're just a little person, God really likes you. And the creator of everything on earth not only likes you, he loves you so much that he came to earth to die for you so that everything would be set right. During Lent, we're thinking about that more than usual because at the end of Lent, it's Easter and we celebrate Jesus' resurrection from the dead. Which is so much more fun if we've spent our time praying and getting close to Him.